Wahala. Tinubu Curtis tension as he refuses to join economic session at summit of world leaders in France. President Bola Tinubu, Nigerian's leader, did not personally participate in a live economic session at the ongoing summit of world leaders in Paris. He said he delegated the tax to the country's ambassador. The reason behind Tinubu's absence on stage remains unclear, particularly since his office he had previously announced his attendance at the summit and his active involvement in a debate about Africans' economic prospects, according to the People's Gazette. The summit, known as the New Global Financing Part Summit, spans two days at Palais de in Paris. Its primary objective is to identify effective solutions for reducing poverty and mitigating the adverse effects of climate change on the global financial system. Scheduled to join other participants on stage at 6.00 p.m. local time to 7.00 p.m. in Nigeria on Thursday, President Tinubu had prepared extensively for the significant event, making his inaugural appearance since assuming office on May 29. However, his place was filled by the Nigerian ambassador, Adamu Ahmed, who shared the stage with notable figures such as David Craig, co-chair of the Tax Force on Nature, Related Financial Disclosures, TNFD, Markani, representing the Glasgow Financial Alliance for Net Zero, GFANZ. Mary Shapiro, the global public policy expert at Bloomberg. Sabina Maderi from the Network for Greening the Financial System and United Nations. Special Envoy Katrina. McKenna. Although it appeared that Mr. Ahmed's speech had been composed hastily, he conveyed an essential message on the behalf of President Bola Metinubu. He emphasized the significance of addressing present pressing social issues in Africa alongside environmental concerns, commending President Marco for highlighting poverty as a key topic at the summit. Hamid highlighted that the economic crisis experienced by African nations post-COVID-19 necessitates a shift away from relying solely on public resources to attract po uh, private capital. He expressed support for President Marco proposal to establish the net zero data public utility nzdpu which african countries perceive as a valuable resource to facilitate their transition and complete globally Ahmed's speech conveyed africans commitment to joining the international commitment in address in addressing climate change and economic challenges, the continent seeks to move beyond more commitment and formulate concrete transition plans. This message echoed Africans' readiness to actively participate in global efforts towards sustainable development and underscore the importance of collaboration between nations in achieving share goals. Nigerians, now don't hear the matter now. They say Bola Ahmed Tunubu, you don't they miss for the summit when he goes so. And people went on react on the talk say, where he go? Where President Bola Ahmed go? Because 
he can't be like say he not want attend the summit. But you should be say he don't reach Paris with that too. But he not just go. So guys, what's your take on this? President Bola Tinubu was represented by the Nigerian ambassador to France in a live economic session at the ongoing summit of world leaders in Paris. The People's Gazette reported on Thursday that Tinubu asked the ambassador to represent him. He said, even though his office had announced that he was in France to attend the summit and participate, in a debate about Africans' economic uh, prospects. Sahara reporters exclusively at the weekend reported that Tinubu would engage on his first official trip as Nigerian president since he may since his May 29 inauguration this week. I beg your pardon. However, top sources in the presidency also revealed that the president's visit was also a strategy to, his, to see his team of medical doctors. But is to attend the Global Financing Part Summit in Paris, France, next week. But this will be his first official trip outside Nigeria since his assumption of duty as president, one of the, the top sources disclosed on Saturday. The trip is to check his health too. It is a strategy to go hospital, another source noted. Sarah reporters had weeks ago reported how Tinubu, after the May 29 swearing in, became exhausted and traveled to France to seek a medical care. So guys, you've all heard it now. Nigerians are really wondering, why did President Bola met Tinubu? Refuse? Why did he fail to attend, you know, to join the live economic session on stage at Paris Summit? Okay, I'm dropping it here. Kindly share your thoughts below. The